what is my African dwarf frog doing? I don't know if you can see him. He is right there in this plant. He's upside down too. Here's a better shot of him. He's alive. He's just hiding in a very weird spot though. The fishies. The fish. Fish, fish, fish. And uh, I just realized that after today's feeding, I don't need to feed my frog with tweezers anymore. I just get the blood worm with my fingers, take it down to him, and he'll eat it right up. It's pretty cool. And uh, I'm hand feeding him mainly because it's the only way I know how to right now. It's the only way I can, and because I want him to get very used to humans being around and I have no idea what my angelfish just did he saw that big splash he made he just freaked out and just jumped out of the tank that was weird oh just shot off the tank it looks gorgeous today probably the best I've ever seen it it's just the plants are just vibrant and green the fish are looking awesome this little fish right here the non glow light he has like a pimple on his lip I I thought it was food at first, but I haven't fed them in a couple hours. It's been a while, so I don't think it's definitely not that, and it's not an air bubble. It looks like a little pimple. It's not ick. I know what ick look. It, I know what ick looks like, and that's not ick. But it look, like I said, it looks like a little pimple. My camera isn't good enough to get an image of it, but there's my sucker fish on the wisteria. He def he loves it back in the wisteria. He's always on it. And look at those new leaves on it. They're just so vibrant and green. I'm in love. Look at them. Look at them. You can see them even better today. Those. 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 And the middle one. Uh, looks like it's getting some. In the middle. Very small. And it's nice though. It's nice. And I'm happy. And I'm excited. And everything's going great. And the frog moved a little. I think he. Nope. He's still upside down. You can see his little head peeking out. Uh, can't really get a good shot because like I said my camera's crap but he's cute. I like him. I like him a lot. I like feeding him too. He's fun to feed and uh, eats the blood worms right up. Might get some other food for him. I'm also looking into going to the store and getting some little terracotta plates or something that I can feed him his pellet food in because like I said he doesn't eat it because once it sinks to the bottom it gets lost in the gravel and he can't find it. And the only way he eats right now is out of my hand, so. I don't know. He, it's fine. I really don't care. Uh, also, I heard they like to hide in terracotta pots, so I want to put one of those in there so he can hide in them. Even though he's pretty well hidden in that plant right now, he hides very well in this tank. I came up earlier and I thought he jumped out of the tank because I couldn't find him. He hid in the very corner of my cave in that dark area. He was nestled in there. I couldn't find him. Uh, he was in the leaves. Not uh, this one, but the ones back there. You can't really see him. There you go. He was under those, and I couldn't see him. And there, he just moved, let out an air bubble, so he might come up for air soon. <sighs> He's something else, though. He's cute. I like him. I don't know if I told you this. I don't think I did, but if I get another one, hopefully it'll be a female. I'll name her Cinderella, and I'll call him Prince Charming. I just thought that'd be funny. There, you can see him better now. Uh, that's just if I get another one. And I kind of hope it's not a female, though, because I don't want them to mate in the tank and then have little frog babies everywhere. That would not make me happy. And like I said, I may not get another one, but I may, I may just do it. I don't know. He's, he's cool though, I like him, my angelfish. Uh, he's just, he's a wreck, I don't know what's wrong with him, I mean just look at him, poor tail is gone, and it looks like the one thin dangly one is like broken, it's like in an angle now, he just looks, he just looks like crap, he's, he's in bad condition, but he's still living, I mean as long as he's alive I'm gonna have him in the tank, and I'm, I'm trying to, sorry if the video's running along, but I'm trying to get a video of him going up for a gulp of air. He just let out a little burp. So hopefully he swims up to the top soon. 
his nice fat little belly. He's still very small, but you know, looks it looks good. Make sure his belly's nice and full when I'm feeding him. Make sure he gets enough. And like I said, the tank is just looking incredible. Just look at it. Just look at that. It's so beautiful. I love my tank. I love it. I love it. 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 There's just something about it. All the live plants and the fish and everything else. Look at the sucker fish. Look at him. There he goes. I also really like the glow lights. They're really pretty. They add a lot of movement to the tank. They kind of fill in the area. They look pretty. I like them. And they do, for the most part, stay tightly schooled together. Look. He's inching to the top. I think he might go soon. There he is. Right there. Little froggy. Little froggy froggy. Alright. Well, whatever. Bye.